hours because I went out yesterday and today I'm meeting my sister at the airport. This is the Riga airport with the funky green taxi. She is supposed to arrive in a few minutes. Super excited. We've been calling each other quite often so I see her every few days on camera over Skype or Facebook but it's one thing to see a person face to face and uh, the other one on camera. It's an exciting moment. That's the arrival terminal. Right there. We came to the wrong arrival terminal so we're moving to the other one. Apparently there are two. I remember them having only one. It's chilly. I wish I had a jacket. Oh, and by the way, don't mind me. I woke up about half an hour ago and I didn't have time to put on makeup or fix my hair. It is what it is. Give me, give me uh, an interview. How do you feel after the flight? I don't have any. What is your name? Not common. <laughs> Introduce yourself. <laughs> Someone is shy on camera. We're heading out to uh, to go back to the car and drive home. We have quite a party planned for tonight. It was on my list of places to visit, places that I remember from childhood. So it was always on my mind to come back and uh, try the sushi again. We started with the beer. Cheers. We had a long night yesterday. We were having some beer as uh, part of the breakfast to make ourselves feel a little bit better. Mm. These are the sushi. This roll was 5 euros, it was on a special 2 for 1 and there's Philadelphia, some Ikura, some Tamago, the uh, Japanese omelette and some lettuce. It was good. Let's eat. Our mains just arrived. We chose a Singapore slaw. Karama! We chose Singapore noodle slaw and it was 4 euros 90 cents, so almost 5 euros. And as a meat dish, we got chicken in honey and tomato sauce with vegetables. And this is a smaller portion and it was 6 euros 90 cents, so 7 euros plus 5 euros, so it's about 12 euros. It's more than enough for us to share with the sushi that we got and uh, we're also having something for dessert. Should be should be good. We're gonna dig in. Smells delicious, heavenly. And now the best part of the meal. Something that I was really looking forward to having again. This is the dessert. Sweet sushi. It's basically a crepe with cream cheese and strawberry and then vanilla sauce. And this was 4 euros and 90 cents. Never tried anything like that in any other country in the world. Even though I travel so much, still never came across sweet sushi. Super excited to try it again. This is so fattening, but I don't care, I'm on vacation. As good as four years ago. Man, I don't know what they put in them. There's something with the cream cheese. It's like it's so fluffy. I think maybe sour cream or something. Literally, guys, don't tell us. It tastes like heaven. Grab a bite, otherwise I'll eat them all. We just paid for the bill. To sum up, our lunch slash early dinner was 24 euros and 50 cents for the both of us with beer. Just wanted to let you know that in Latvia, in Riga, 
usually people tip about 10% from the bill. Not like in North America when it tends to be anywhere between 15 to 20. And also keep an eye on the bill if it includes the service charge. Because you're in Latvia, it's uh, written in Latvian language. But otherwise, it's gonna say Akal Poshina, which means service charge. And it's at zero. So we'll definitely leave We'll leave 3 euros because the girl was really good. Unfortunately, the service in Riga is not that great. It's not on the same level as in some other European countries or definitely not on the same level as North America. We really enjoyed uh, our lunch and next step is to go and explore the city, film a little, take a few pictures and just enjoy ourselves. We'll see you in all Riga.